Hey everybody, it's Chainsaw Reacts back once again with another reaction for you guys. Today, guys, we're checking out Guillermo del Toro's Pinocchio official teaser trailer that dropped a few minutes ago. I believe this is the first time we're seeing actual footage of this film. I could be wrong. If I am wrong, please let me know in the comments below. But I do think this is our first official time seeing footage. We've seen images from this film, but I think this is our first official time seeing actual footage. And so I'm really excited to see what's going to happen here because I haven't seen any footage of anything has dropped before this. But regardless. This is exciting. When I first heard about this announcement, I was like, he is going to be taking a very different approach, I think, to Pinocchio. Of course, there's going to be some similarities, of course, to the Pinocchio story, but Guillermo del Toro, he's very picky on what projects he selects and what he does, and his style is very unique. So I know that once this was announced and it was in development for quite some time, that this is going to be very unique. And the cast is insane in this movie. Ewan McGregor, Tilda Swinton, just alone, that's freaking crazy. So... I'm not going to waste any more time. I want to get into this. I want to see, you know, what he's going to be doing here. This is going to give us a real sense of what this movie is going to be. And I'm really excited to see what's here. So here we go, guys. Guillermo del Toro, Pinocchio, official season trailer. Let's get into that, guys, and see what that shows. Let's go. From my many Whoa. wanderings on this earth. How do I hear him? I had so much to say about imperfect fathers and imperfect sons. I like that. And about loss mm. and love. I've learned that there are old spirits who rarely involve themselves in the human world, but on occasion, they do. Looks great so far. I want to tell you a story. It's a story you may think you know, but <laughs> you don't. You don't. A story. The Wooden Boy. Mm. Wow. Where am I? I feel as though you've been here before. The Wooden Boy with the borrowed soul. Be his son. Fill his days with light. We shall call you Pinocchio. Day. That looks good. It does. This was honestly delightful. <laughs> That's the only word I can think of because it, it seemed so fun and it seemed like this is going to be a pretty interesting telling of the Pinocchio story. And of course, like I was saying in the intro, it's going to Toro. Of course, he's going to have his own unique spin on it and he's going to bring his own unique style to this story. I love how it opens it, Ewan speaking there and um saying you know you, you think you've heard this story but you really don't i, I like that um like I, we saw the stat cast we saw that ron perlman of course ron perlman has to be in this of course he does <laughs> he's worked with gilmore toro for so damn long of course he was going to be in this i i, I don't remember they, I, don't, I don't remember if they announced him maybe they already did ahead of time i just can't remember but regardless <laughs> this looks like it's going to be interesting and i and and Obviously, you can't just say, oh, this movie, this can be a good movie. This can be a good movie. Because we don't know for sure. We have no idea. But I have faith that this is going to be at least very interesting. And it's probably going to end up being good because it's Gilmore del Toro. Okay, he knows what he's doing. Okay. Like, he, he he's very picky with his projects. And I think telling this story is a unique direction, I think, for sure. Because as we know, he likes to tell his own stories. Like, you know, he likes to, like, use his time on like he of course works on a lot of different projects but whenever he is really attached to something very specifically where literally it's in the name Guillermo del Toro you know like he makes sure his name is attached to it it's usually his own stories things that he's coming up with or he's helping you know create with other people and in this instance he's telling a very classic story so that's a very interesting thing I don't know if he's ever done something like this before in terms of telling a, a story that's you know a classic story or somebody else i'm trying to think i honestly can't remember maybe he's done some other stuff in the past but it's not clicking in my head right now and maybe once you guys say something that he may have done I'm like oh i didn't even think about that it just tends to happen it's, it's in the it's early in the morning not really early but i'm still waking up essentially <laughs> but this trailer was interesting for sure i like the look of it i love the style of the uh, of the look of it and i'm ready i'm ready i don't need to see any more footage just drop the movie <laughs> 
it's not rated yet, which is interesting. I'm, I'm curious why they haven't rated the movie because they made a point to show this film has not yet been rated. Like, okay, <laughs> is there any question about what kind of rating it has been? I, maybe there is. I have no idea. <laughs> but anyways, so what do you think of the, the official teaser trailer for uh, Pinocchio, Guillermo del Toro's Pinocchio? What do you guys think of it? Are you excited for the film? Um, what do you think? How do you think he's going to uh, approach the story differently? I mean, it looks definitely interesting for sure, and looks like it might go in a little bit of a different direction in terms of what we're expecting. Because they make a point for him to say, "You think you know this story, you really don't." So, you know, I'm not really sure about that. Anyways, that's the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. I will talk to you guys soon. Peace out, everybody.